Shen Murray, Region 2. Recently, I got married and moved to Region 2 with my husband, who is also a teacher. We bought a home there and in Albany. We love our community. We're excited to be there. But the budget cuts mean that I am very low on the totem pole, and so it is possible I won't have a job next year. And for me, that's, that's very disconcerting. However, because we don't have children, we're not as concerned about it as some of our ESPs who are barely making a living as it is, and they are facing drastic draconian budget cuts also. I have 40 children in my reading group. I teach fourth grade. That's ridiculous. They're not getting the education that they deserve. They're not getting the education that I had or that you had, and it's not fair. I think it's, it's an abomination that we don't fund education in this state. It needs to be a priority and a bigger priority than it is. Please fund education. It needs to be a priority and stop the giveaways. It's not that you have the opportunity to prevent money from going out. And I am more than willing to pay my taxes. I don't like paying taxes, no one does. But I am more than willing to pay my taxes to make sure that we have public services, including public education. These are, these are things that make it great to live in Oregon. And when you give away money to corporations with the kicker, when you give me $16 back uh, just before Christmas, it's a little more now, that really doesn't do too much for me. But um, it does make me think about the kids that are at school that are bringing their uh, food rations from gift boxes in to donate at our canned food drive because that's how great our kids are and they want to help people who are less fortunate, even, even in their very unfortunate situations. What I'm more concerned about are the 40 children in my reading group, and I can't get to every single one of them every day. When you're learning to read or reading to learn, you deserve to have a teacher that can meet with you and read with you every day, and that just doesn't happen because of budget cuts, and it's only going to get worse next year. Whether I'm there or not, it's only going to get worse.